The Delhi High Court has pulled up the Pilots Association of Air India and questioned the loss uh, that they have caused to the Exchequer. Uh, the Delhi High Court has also questioned the motive of the Indian Commercial Pilots Association for the strike call. Let's go across to Jagori Dhar, who has uh, all the latest detail. It's day seven of the strike, Jagori. Is there any breakthrough? No, Damana, unfortunately, as it's been a one week now and the strike continues, but today is an important day. As you mentioned, the Delhi High Court is going to hear the proceedings and the contempt to case against three ICPA members, the President, the General Secretary and the Regional Secretary. Already the High Court has uh, clamped down heavily on the, both the managements and the pilots by declaring this strike illegal. They have uh, said that the strike is not on large public good, but also a, uh, a thing that the... ICPA members can take heart from the observations of the Delhi High Court is that they have appointed an independent lawyer, Siddharth Lutra, who would be continuing the proceedings for the Delhi High Court. So remember, he's, go he's an in independent entity and he's, not, uh, he's going to independently work and uh, give his observations to the High Court. So there is some sort of hope with the, among the pilots that there would be, they would be following the proceedings impartially. Also, the Delhi High Court today pulled up the Air India management by saying that they are not taking this manus, this uh, strike seriously. Obviously, uh, the Air India management is under a lot of a, a lot of uh, attack after uh, after the strike has been continuing for so long, and there's been no breakthrough. So, really, Samanna, uh, later today at 2:30, the High Court will again hear the case, and we are right. the High Court.